Hello Cyberji, my name is Ubiji. Welcome to Clip Mind. We tend to romanticize that jealousy can be a justification of feeling deeply in love. It is something that has been assumed for many years. Some people enjoy having a jealous partner and find it cute and attractive when their partner acts that way because they feel like the center of their partner's attention. Too much of anything can be unhealthy. Jealousy is a normal human emotion. They are there to tell us that we see a potential threat and we need to guard those we love. However, when jealousy becomes too much with irrational thought and unacceptable behaviors, it can rapidly destroy our relationship that we are afraid to lose. People become jealous only in response to firm evidence that their partner may be physically or emotionally involved with someone else. In contrast, pathological jealousy is a false belief of irrelevant occurrences that their partner is being unfaithful. People with pathological jealousy have a wrong perception of reality and it can lead to violent behaviors. In this video, we will explain 5 signs of pathological jealousy. But before we jump into that, if you are new to this channel and you interest to promoting the awareness about mental health, please consider to subscribe our channel and be part of us. Now let's get into topic. Cybergy Jealousy is a complex emotion that most people have experienced in their life. Jealousy can range from normality to pathological depending on intensity, reasonability, persistence, and irrationality. In a nutshell, normal jealousy is an understandable reaction to their lover's unfaithfulness and they can modify their beliefs and reactions if a new evidence raises contradictory to their beliefs. In pathological jealousy, the level of jealousness goes beyond acceptable society and they refuse to change their beliefs of unfaithfulness even when their conclusions are irrelevant and new evidence contrary to their thoughts is provided. Here are 5 signs of pathological jealousy. They always check your phone. Whenever you are with them, they are always asking for your phone. They will check your messages, browser history, Instagram, email account, and any social media application you use. They also interrogate your history calls and question you about every conversation you have. When you refuse to keep your phone, they will get angry and accuse you that you have hidden something from them. Even when you have nothing to hide and you never have a history of infidelity, they require you to check in all the time. Do you feel like living under the microscope because your partner is monitoring your whereabouts every time? They constantly want to know what you're doing, who you're with. They might show up to see if you're where you're supposed to be. And they also insist that you must tell them where you go or you have to ask their permission if you want to spend your time with your friends and family. When you are away, they always call, text you countless times, and expect immediate responses. So you keep your phone close at hand because you are afraid if you don't reply fast enough, they will become suspicious and get angry. If this happens to you, you might feel like your life is not yours anymore. And you will gradually stop seeing your friends and family because you want to avoid conflict with your partner. Constant accusations of infidelity. Does your partner constantly question your fidelity? Is your fidelity a predominant topic of conversation? You get accused of being too friendly, having affairs, 
dressing too provocatively, flirting with others even when you do go out with them. They are repeated accusations which they cannot prove. No matter how much you reassure them of your faithfulness, they are always suspicious. Establishing an excuse for their jealous behavior and never believe you. Being falsely accused of lying, wrongdoing, cheating can lead you to develop some psychological disorders and rob your happiness. So, if you are the victim of this, please seek out for help. Help is available and you deserve to be treated with respect. They isolate you. Does your partner make rules about who you can talk to? They might have a list of people you are not allowed to interact with, including exes, flirty co-workers, attractive strangers, philanderer or philanderous friends, and your best friends. They will provide you with various reasons such as it makes them uncomfortable, they are afraid those people will manipulate you, or they don't trust those people. After a long period of time, their demand went up. They cut off your communication with people who support and love you, drive away your co-workers, keep you from furthering your education, or sabotage your career. Once you refuse their demands, it means you are ready to go to war. Hostile and aggressive behavior to project their jealousy. Many researchers show jealousy is often associated with threats and violence directed at the suspected partner and the third party. Many people project their jealousy with rage, verbal attacks, and physical abuse, and many researchers show that domestic violence is often triggered by sexual jealousy and accusations of infidelity. Cybergy Those were five signs of pathological jealousy. A mild form of jealousy can be considered good because it is expressed that we value them and don't want to lose them. But too much jealousy can be destructive, so it is important to find the right balance. If those signs relate with you or someone you do, we suggest you seek help from professional help. This video content is not intended to be a substitute for professional medical advice. If you like this video, please share it with your friends. Thank you for watching and see you in the next topics. Bye-bye.